I'm here with Money Fields manager Glenn Turnbull and man on a match Marco De Souza today after our 3 1 Wessex League victory here against Shaftesbury. First of all, Glenn, what were your overall thoughts on the performance? Yeah, delivered the game plan. To be fair, felt we were unlucky to go in 1 0 down at half time. Their bench, as ever, saying all the usual sorts of things. Oh, they've had a five minute spell. I'd be interested to watch the VO back. I thought we were better side first half to be honest I think we missed two chances Ryan's hit the bar we've had a tap in if we've got a little bit of composure in front of goal but we go in one nil down in the calm we controlled we didn't um, lose it I thought the, the two sent two of the three centre half stepping out with the way we could break them down they were dead on their feet everyone was saying it both the full backs were absolutely shattered and I just think I think Ryan Penry said at half time we win this 3-1 and to be honest, we were, they were lucky it was 3 1. Marco, man, a match for you as well. How, how, are you, how are you feeling your overall personal games going at the moment? Uh, yeah, glad, glad of a man, a match, obviously. But I think all the boys deserve a special shout out today. It all worked superbly. It's very hard. And I think it just shows the character in our group like, that we've got to go in 1 0 down and still come back and get the victory. And even the last couple of games, we've been pushing right to the end. It shows how hard we've worked in pre season, bringing into the season. And yeah, just. It's a good result for the boys. This will be your first couple of month, well, months or so here at the club. How how much are you enjoying it? Uh, like I said, from, from the start, from the pre season, it was I, I felt there was something special about the group. I've, the group took me in. I, it felt it felt like home straight away. And I've always said like I, I think I play my best football where I feel at home and where I'm enjoying it. And I'm like more than happy here, and wouldn't want to play anywhere else to be honest. So Glenn. Overall, after this victory, it's a big sort of statement really against the side that you'd expect to be up there is, in the end of the season. Jim, it is. Jim said there, yeah, as you do, you know, a bit of banter near the end. Yeah, well done. I'd we'll see you at the end of the season. You've won nothing yet. That's what we've just gone in and said to the lads. September. We don't get carried away. It's another three points on the board. It's another plus two in the goal difference. Keep moving on. We know what we think we can achieve as a group. We know what the club wants us to achieve. People still forget we're doing all of this with have balls, have kit, we'll travel. So we'll, we'll, we'll keep doing what we need to do. And with any luck, when we get in the ground in the next next month or so, we can see where we are and maybe push again. Micah, how tough was it coming up against someone like Brett Putman, of course, playing up front for Shaftesbury? It's I mean, part of the very good forward line for them. I mean, it's, all, it's always a privilege to test yourself against like an ex-pro. Um, you always want to test yourself against the best. And, I feel like that, that's why that's why I've come here, I try to develop myself as a player, to play, play against the best possible and just improve myself with the overall game. Thanks very much for speaking to us. Cheers mate. Thank you.